Ellen's a good girl. Oh my goodness. Good girl. Oh my goodness. So excited for 7 a.m. Good morning, everyone. This is not a normal morning, but she has a lot of energy today, so I'm just throwing a toy in the garden. Her morning routine is typically, she eats, she wakes me up, she eats breakfast, and then she goes back to sleep, normally in our bed, with Benji typically. So we're gonna just get some energy out of her now. She'll go back to sleep while I get ready this morning, and then we'll take her for a walk. Welcome back to another home vlog. Today's video is very kindly sponsored by Dermatica Skincare. I've been working with them for a while now. I'm looking forward to sharing a bit more about them today, if you haven't heard them before. We're also going to be doing some holiday prep today, so I'm going to show you my sort of travel checklist and routine before I go on a trip. We're going to get the suitcase out of the loft, just going to start that kind of process before I go away. We're going to Disneyland in less than two weeks now. What even is this anyway? It's a Christmas carrot. If you're new around here, hi, my name is Brogan. I make travel, home and lifestyle vlogs, so please hit subscribe if you haven't already. So I don't have too much in today apart from sort of chatting to you about holiday stuff. I want to go and get some dollars, check all my like mini toiletries, see what needs replacing. I think we need some more sun cream. It's the end of the summer now, isn't it? So I'm sure we've probably run out. I think Benji's got a couple in his golf bag now. So yeah, I think we need some more. Benji's going to the gym uh, with a friend, play tennis this morning. I might join, even if it's just a walk on the treadmill, you know, get a workout in, break up the day as well. I did want to go for an outdoor swim because it's been such lovely weather, but I don't know. Shall I, shan't I? I'm actually gonna take my cup of tea and get back into bed and read my book for about half an hour and then we'll start getting ready for the day. Welcome back to another home vlog. Good morning. <laughs> you are so cute, Bonnie. Look at her little tail. <laughs> I am ready for the day now. I am gonna go to the gym in a minute with Benj. I've got my gym gear on. I've got my hair in a pony. Skincare is all done. Speaking of skincare, so many of you have complimented me on my skin saying that I look really glowy and lovely. So thank you so much for that. I've certainly noticed the difference. I felt so much more confident recently and I feel really ready for our wedding day now. So the reason for my skin glowing the way it is is down to my new favorite skincare product, which is Dermatica. I say new, I'm on month five now. So I'm still loving and using Doatica. I have talked about them a couple of times, but if you haven't heard of them before, they are a personalized formula that you can have delivered straight to your door. It comes in a box like this. I just got my new one in the post. So I'm actually a loyal customer now. I pay for this myself too, although they sponsor. They send you your formula that lasts 28 days, but you can delay your subscription and things like that. It's helped my redness and my fine lines on my forehead. You can kind of see in these before and after pictures. It's not dramatic, but it's certainly noticeable to me and it's just kept my skin really clear. I have a lot less breakouts now which is amazing but they also help support with things like rosacea, hyperpigmentation, melasma and so if you have any skin concerns or just looking for something to help you, Dermatica is the perfect place. They actually have a dermatology team that monitor your progress. You can send them pictures and updates and they will ensure that you receive the most effective and appropriate treatment for your skin. So it's personalized. I I actually introduced a new serum in my routine recently and I asked them if the ingredients would be okay and they got back to me super quickly and told me that it was all okay and I really appreciated having that support 24 seven. You apply it at night in the evening for your evening routine and as you can see, this is just me doing that, exactly that. So my cleanser, then my serum, then my treatment and then moisturizer and this has been the dream combination. So if like me, you'd like to start your skin journey with Dermatica, you can use my code BROGAN, click the link below and that will get you your first personalized formula for only £2.90 and then 10% off your next one, which is £24.99. So definitely check them out. I absolutely love them and big thank you to them for sponsoring again today. Let me know if you try this because it genuinely has changed my life and that's why my skin looks as good as it does. our London vlog you'll know that I bought new trainers these are the Adidas ultralight boost or something like that new trainers are going well I've been wearing them to the gym I really like them they're very comfortable very light they've got a nice bit of padding on the back because I suffer with blisters uh, they are quite soft for some of the things I do in my PT sessions so the other day he actually told me to take them off because I was doing some like balance stuff and they were a bit too squishy but for Disney they're going to be perfect and that's really what I want them for I want really good trainers to be able to 
walk around the parks and stuff today i'm just going to do cardio like treadmill um just something light just so i can keep wearing the trainers in there is literally nothing worse than new shoes on a trip and you haven't worn them we're going to go separately because benji's going to go and play tennis with a friend and then he's swimming after but i am just going to go and do my my cardio and then come home and we'll carry on with all the holiday stuff actually i have quite a lot of parcels to sort out today Maybe I should do that. I can definitely see this turning into a bit of an errands day today. So I've got this parcel for Stitch Fix, a Zara and an Amazon order to go back. We've also got a load of cardboard in the boot of my car right now. I need to take to the dump. So maybe we'll do that as well while we're out and about. The other sort of task I need to complete today that's out and about is getting some dollars. Always like to have cash in America for tipping. And I just like to have some currency anyway wherever i go obsessed with this water bottle i actually featured it in my favorites video last week if you haven't seen that already definitely go and watch that i share all the things i've been loving from books and beauty skincare makeup tv apps crafts it was like a real mix i'm actually filming this the week before so um when you see this video it will be going to disney next week i'm also going to do a pack with me at the end of this week that you're watching so you'll see that i love preparing for a holiday and there are so many things to think about before you go away and i have a little list that i wrote on my blog years ago i'll leave it linked and i always go back to it and i make it into a tick list in the notes on my phone when i'm not driving i'll go through the list with you maybe when we stop at the gym right just going to the starbucks drive through clotted cream fudge cold brew sounds nice doesn't it thank you so much thank cheers i have parked at the gym and i'm going to try this cold brew it's nice i'm not getting any like fudge flavor by any means but I thought it'd be a bit more sweet than that. I also have peach and raspberry overnight oats, which are my favorite. Whilst I eat this, let me get up my holiday list. This is my holiday prep list. The minute the trip is booked, check the passports are safe and in date. That could be the make or break of a holiday if you only go to check the passports like the day before you fly. Also on the list, the minute the trip is booked, download all the apps for relevant hotels, airports, airlines, and city guides and things like that, whatever you need. We're just going to Disneyland, so the only app I really needed was the Disneyland app and I added my flight into our Virgin Atlantic app. Print any paperwork and create a holiday documents folder. I'll show you that later. Check visas. So for this one, it was our Estes and they are in date and valid until next year. So that's good. Add any advanced passenger information to the flight booking and pick your seats. Again, I've already done that. Check insurance and purchase a new policy if necessary. Again, don't need to do that because we have annual travel insurance and book our airport transfer. Sorry, I don't know why this is so far over. Should I move that over a bit? There you go. We started weighing up our options in terms of driving and parking and how much that costs versus paying for a transfer and it started becoming better for us to pay for a local taxi service to drive us to the airport and that's because fuel has got more expensive and car parking is really expensive but also when we do long haul flights like LA we'll be so jet lagged when we land and neither of us want to do that long drive so I have booked us some transfers so we don't have to stress they just pick us up from the house and take us to the airport and it's lovely then just before the trip I take the luggage out of the loft and clean it and air it out and all that kind of stuff create a packing list try on all my wardrobe check our savings and final budget and then book my nails and things like that so i've done most of those things the only thing i haven't done is get the luggage and then the next list is sort of like the week before so that is stuff i do like a month before purchase any currency start organizing essential items to check if anything needs replacing like sun cream or travel size shampoo and conditioner etc check the first aid kit and replenish anything that we may have used like plasters or creams or check anything as expired because it's easy to just leave stuff in there research restaurant and things to do and recommendations finalize the packing list and the itinerary i need to add my pins to my lanyard a disney thing uh order extra contact lenses which i've already done and wash any clothes that i'd like to pack that need washing etc and then the last thing on the list is just a few days before is to charge all my gadgets and clear the memory cards uh, start packing obviously cut any tags out from new clothing nothing more annoying than when you forget to do that so always do that need to go to my nail appointment paint my toenails shave my legs all that kind of stuff purchase any replacement toiletries buy snacks to take on the plane put my out of office on download any songs apps and netflix shows wash my makeup brushes 
Um, I think that's it. That is my big travel prep list. I'm gonna finish my breakfast, let my food go down a bit, finish my coffee, do some emails, because I've had quite a few come in this morning, and have a chat with my manager, probably give her a call, just see where we're at for the week. It's actually Wednesday today, did I say that? It's Wednesday, but is that. I've had a shower. I'm not sure that black is the best colour to be wearing when it's like almost 30 degrees, but alas, that's what I've chosen. Benji's home too. I saw you in the pool. You did. Look how hot it is here. <laughs> the, Look, the butter the has melted butter. and gone all over the side. Oh no. We've had that out all summer. Yeah, it's not it done that. Done I think that's um oh dear speaking of how hot it is i am just going to reapply my sun cream this is actually a dermatica one that i talked about in a few vlogs back love it we're going to take this to california with us as well so as i've washed my face again reapply this also this is a dermatica lip balm as well this is called their restoring ceramide skin balm for all skin types you can use it in loads of places it's one of those like multi balms but yeah i've been using this too the packaging looks like this. They didn't ask me to show you this. I've just been struggling with my lips, so I needed something else. I was going to try and have my hair half up, half down. I'm trying not to wash my hair as often, and I only washed it, was it yesterday? It's too hot to blow dry it, and I don't want it wet down my back of my neck. So, do you know what? I was trying to make it look cute, but why? Let's just put it in a bun. The first thing I want to do is order a new mini fan. I've talked about these little fans forever, but these are the two that I have. This is obviously my bigger one. I got this in 2018. Benji has it in black. It has served me so well. This one has been equally as good. It's not quite as powerful as the bigger one, obviously, but it's still so perfect for chucking it in a bag. And I take it to the gym every time. And when I'm on the treadmill, even if I'm doing like an hour and have it going, I will have it going in my face and it's so amazing but this one is just a little bit better and california is looking quite warm and this one is like starting to go like i don't know if you could see that when i press the button it's like a little bit sticky and it's full of like dust it's on its last legs and i refuse to go to disneyland without it so it's 12.99 currently on offer which is a good price so i'm just going to order myself another one then i'm going to renew our tv license then i need to do emails which i have 45 to do some of them are from girl guiding they are asking my availability for things so i need to sort that out immediately and then i am waiting for my manager to come back to me because one of my regular brands I work with, a bit like Dermatica, but they um, are on a long-term partnership with me until the end of the year. I need to know what they want me to promote for the next campaign that we're working on together. Um, so I need them to tell me, confirm with me what they'd like on that. So that's what I'm doing. I need to decide if I'm gonna go and get dollars today and I kind of feel like I want to because if I don't go today, I'm gonna forget. Um, and I wanna get the suitcases out. Oh, and I need to check the air tags in the suitcases. So yeah, we still have a lot to do, but first, Let's get this going and I've got it um, on me right now in the office because it's so hot. So what we have with Benji Lever's catering services today yep. is we have a wrap with lettuce, <laughs> cucumber, tomato, avocado, mm -hmm. chicken, um, a bit of cheese and a little bit of Nando's Peronese, Lovely. some bunny, bunny bites. bites. Yeah. Like little, little caramel. Well. Nice, thank you. I have just finished my lovely lunch that Benji made me. It was delicious. And my friend Adam FaceTimed me, so I had company while I ate my lunch. So we caught up quickly, just chatting about work and life. But I've just replied to all the comments on my Home Sense vlog. So thank you so much if you watched that and the favourites. I really, really appreciate it. In about 10 minutes, I'm going to call Benji up and we're going to get the suitcases out because that is important. Alrighty, let's go and look at my travel prep so far then, shall we? So this is how I plan for a trip. So I pulled out some outfits that I think I'm going to take. It's only for five days, but I do imagine I'll be changing some days if we go back to the hotel, have a break, and then get a change for the evening. And what I'll do in the next couple of days is try them all on, and then I'll show you which ones I end up packing. And then this is how I start to pack, and then obviously you'll see the finished stuff in the Pack With Me video. So I've got the folder I mentioned earlier with all our paperwork, so I've printed those things out. Passports are over there, I've started some snacks. And then Disney stuff is just a little bit chaotic sometimes because I have many ears and 
bags and accessories and look it's just a bit silly so we need to obviously condense some of this down i've pulled out like my halloween is aren't these so cute in fact actually how nice would they look with that outfit i feel like that'd be cute what do you think bench yeah i like this fall colors isn't aren't it? they nice yeah i think that'll look really good so yeah i need to do my pins benj i wanted to ask you actually as i'm chatting to the vlog you know all these pins we've been buying so we've been well we've been, me we've been buying, yeah. i have been hoarding these pins because i've been getting them for really good prices for like two pound i don't think i've spent more than three pound or they're ones that i already have duplicates of so i don't know what to do with these do i i don't really want to carry the cards the backing cards so i feel like should i put them all on a lanyard and then, yeah, and then that's i can just trade with, right? yeah trade with them i need to sort this out in fact i don't love this lanyard because it's actually quite big yeah, ideally it, hangs really low, doesn't it? it does hang low i feel like i want to cut it off like cut this section off and undo the stitching yeah the loft is going to be horrible i already have my little case out because i used it to go to london recently so we need to establish which cases we want because have i got a big one you have got a big one Two large ones or medium? No, it's only well, five days. It doesn't matter, don't overthink it. We're going to be bringing loads of stuff back. Oh. The same size as mine? Yeah. They're quite big. Do you think that's a bit excessive? What? What's the difference? We're still going to need two suitcases. By using smaller ones, we're not going to save any. It's just we went to Florida for two weeks with smaller than that. But, but we'll, we won't fill them up, but we'll fill them up on the way back. I've just changed, put on a bit of a nicer dress to go to the shops. This one is from Joni. I absolutely love this dress, actually. I've been starting to think about which dresses I really love. Like, what are the ones that are staples that make me feel good? Because I can only pack dresses I love for our big cruise. And I feel like this is one of them, you know? Floaty sleeves, like, hits me in all the right places. Not too long, not too short. So Ben just managed to remove that big clip that was on my lanyard that was making it really chunky and he's re-put the plastic Disney 100 thing on the bottom of it. Oh the car park is so quiet which means hopefully the shops are nice and quiet too. I'm just thinking I might want to buy some new uh what they called air tags because we've obviously got the new cases so unless I go back in the loft and swap the old air tags that are in the other suitcases. I mean, we may as well get more because when we do our trip next year, we're gonna want more. So I'm gonna put that on my list, uh, new air tags. I absolutely love Sainsbury's clothing. Absolutely gorgeous. They have some nice autumn winter things coming in. Some really cute midi dresses and some of them are really nice transitional ones. I'm obsessed with this one. How gorgeous is that? They don't have my size. That was a successful trip. I got the travel money, the dollars. I got a thank you card for a friend that I've been wanting to pick up for a while. I got a little razor and some body sun cream because I already have face from Dermatica. I also got the air tags for the cases from Argos. And I got some food bits for the house. Anything else? Oh, I got a curl spray for my hair to try as well as it was half price in super drug um but that is everything i think i'm home i'm just putting away the food bits and the other things i got remember that, that video in which we showed ourselves probably for what good 10 hours <laughs> stripping this whole room out the making... utility room declutter the last home vlog that's what you mean mm. yes yeah. oh lovely oh what happened bench how long was it clean for Three days. Not even that. And it's what have you week. decided to do? Rip out the bathroom! Finally! It's been on our list forever. Like it? years, yeah, actual years. Look at it. Work top that matches, that matches the old kitchen. Yeah, we want Don't to get rid like of that. The blue. No, Don't the tiles the were horrible. The tiles were horrible. Yeah. The floor. Oh gosh, the floor. I don't know if you can see it. Yeah. <laughs> Every time we walked in there, it would like the collapse in. Radiator leaked, so we could we had to. Oh the yeah. Radiator turned off with a cock and one. It just needed doing, didn't it? It did. It's the last room in the house that needed like renovating. Yeah. But you're on it. It's a little project, isn't it? Yeah, I got a, like a big spike of motivation. Um, now it's dipped. That's fine. We're not in a major rush. Look at your hair. It's all flapping all over. I'm sweating. Yeah, my, I'm sweating too. You love your ice bath, don't you? And your ice maker. Look at you. And my ice maker. We yeah. use this every day since we've got it. We'll show you it and remind you it for those of you that are new. He's got one of these Lumi ice baths. I love it. It's the best thing I've ever bought. I use it 
every day that I'm home. Yesterday I used it twice, didn't I? I used it in the morning before golf. Yeah. And then I used it in the evening to help like my muscles. Only mild issue is it's only got three and three layers of insulation. So it doesn't stay cold, cold. Yeah. from like one morning to the next morning. So I have to have a whole load of ice in, obviously. If you were to get one for, for yourself, for yourself yeah. get the, I think it's 150 pounds, a little bit more, but then again, that's, they've got a discount. It's got like six layers of insulation. It's a bit big, it's a bit wider, a bit bigger, a bit taller. I fit in this fine. I'm 6'3", and I fit in this fine. Yeah. Get my shoulders fully in and everything. But you're feeling the effects, like you're feeling like it's helping oh, with your yeah. recovery. I feel like I can do something every day. Whereas if I kind of left it and didn't get in the ice bath, yeah. I'd probably wake up aching tomorrow. It is so unbearably hot that I've had to put my pyjamas on and it, I think it's actually cooler outside. I might actually go and sit in the garden because it's just too hot. But before I do, I wanted to design my lanyard. So most of these pins I bought on the Shop Disney website or in store so yeah this pirates cabbie one was originally nine pound and i paid two pound 19. i love pin trading i love the thrill of finding like a really cute pin sorry i've got the fan on next to me because it's too much but um <laughs> it's it's not looking cute i've got two of the same next to each other now but never mind cool lanyard completed it this heat is not it for a poor little bonnie girl it's hot isn't it it's 7 p.m and it's still hot Actually, it's 20 to 8. Oh my gosh, where's the evening going? Where's the evening going? Benji has finished her dinner. We don't have a HelloFresh tonight, so this is one of those meals that we have midweek when, you know, we need to be in between our two HelloFresh boxes. So we've got a salmon, fish cake, mash, and some carrots. This evening, we are going to be watching Only Murders in the Building. Season 3 has just dropped recently, and it comes out every Tuesday. So we've got an episode to watch for this week. We are enjoying it, but it's been a bit slow and I find myself losing interest a little bit. So I'm hoping we're gonna start picking up a bit this week, but we'll report back and let you know what we think. I don't get it. I'm really struggling this season. I have no idea what character's who. Yeah, I don't know who, I don't get it. I'm I'm not feeling gripped like I was in season one and two. We're six episodes in and nothing's happened. I'm really hoping yeah. that like eight, nine, and ten are just like, oh my god, oh, it all I can't comes wait. together. Just getting ready to get into bed, and I've just done my cleanser and serum, so I'm just going to pop on my dermatica treatment as well every single night. I'm going to pop on my evening night cream as well on top. I've got some under the eye patches that I'm going to put on as well in a minute. It's quarter past nine. I'm in bed. We're going to stick our aircon unit on in a minute and I'm going to read for like 45 minutes or so. But some of you want to know how I'm getting on with the Kindle. So I recently figured out how to make the screensaver the actual book that I'm reading. And I also shared a YouTube short of my cover sticker thing i put this on instagram as well i'm not sure how i feel about this yet but you can go and watch that if you want to know more about my sticker cover thing i'm going to take these off because they're annoying me too much so far i'm enjoying the kindle so much more than i thought i would i really love a physical book so i knew that it would be a really different feel to reading but i find myself reading a lot quicker than a physical book i like seeing how far in i am and as i'm reading it's just so easy to just tap it along change the brightness and it's so light it's much nicer much more comfortable when i'm in bed i went to the doctors yesterday for a smear test and i took the kindle with me and sat in the waiting room with it and it was so much easier than carrying a big book so there's definitely like pros and cons and perks to it but i am actually really loving it because i had a kindle before but i just didn't love it and i don't know whether that was because i didn't love reading as much as i do now but yeah so far so good and like i don't know a week two weeks in something like that i'll report back on how much i use it on our trip because we've got a long haul flight coming up so the next video you're going to see speaking of disney is actually going to be the pack with me so that'll be coming up on sunday hopefully i want to upload it before i leave and we fly on monday so make sure you keep an eye out for that i still have so much prep to do clearly i want to wash my brushes and I've got loads of beauty prep to do and I obviously need to actually pack. Big thank you to Dermatica for sponsoring. Like I said, the link will be below and the code is BROGAN which gets you your first personalised treatment for only £2.90 and your second one for 10% off. So really good chance to try it and see how you get on. That was everything today. Thank you again for watching this very random home vlog today. Um, it's been lovely catching up with you. So have a good rest of the week and I'll see you again very soon. Bye!